Can you give voice to how the bubble is affecting some of this? The fact is, again, that the players, and because we had Kenny the Jet Smith on yesterday who brought this up about uh, this subject, um, and we all know that he demiked on live television last night um, inside the NBA studio um, yeah. and said that, you know, he just didn't feel like he didn't feel like it and that he was doing that in solidarity of players. But anyway, he, he, he mentioned that the bubble, adding the fact that you were there, that the players don't can't be about it sitting in the bubble. And so how is that affecting everything, do you think, Chris? Yeah, I think I think we need to – let's. so we'll get to that bubble, but you know the bubble we're in now where you can't hug your friend, you can't see your grandmother. I, I really think – that everything has to be a perfect storm. And this was the perfect storm for activism because there's no distractions. There weren't, there aren't the sports. It's not the college football ramping up all the other things that, that I like they are, but then it hasn't been on TV. And so I think the world has gotten a chance to see what really goes on and watch the news probably way too much and see these same incidents happen. And I think here in the bubble, it, um, so I've been here about two weeks now, and it's it's weird. It's different. I've never been away from my kids this long. Uh, so you're dealing with different emotions. Um, and for these guys, I think the bubble affected them that they're in their rooms. I mean, you can play golf. You can maybe walk around outside, but you can't leave the, the campus of the hotel. And I think a lot of these guys feel like I'm, I'm not using the value that I have that I'm wasting my value, that I could be doing something. And they and they may feel like it's frustrating that I'm here and not doing anything while the world is burning, you, you know. Um, and, and so I do think the bubble has had an effect on guys and their anxiousness and, and them wanting to speak out and wanting to do something. But I sense that from everybody, from everybody. People just going to work are tired. People, you know, you know, kids can't go to school. I, I just think the frustration and seeing what it is, people are just calling for peace. That's all it is. People just want peace in the midst of all this storm. And I think that being in a bubble has let guys really sit and focus on it for hours at a time. And um, and they just want to do something about it. 